Thank you for purchasing the Profile Ultra Fast Combo Washer and Dryer. Your combo is GE Appliances Wi-Fi Connect enabled, and it is highly recommended that you connect your combo to Wi-Fi if you have not already done so. This will allow you to download the latest software and allow you to receive periodic updates and benefits from many of the extended features available through the Smart HQ app. Go to the Wi-Fi section of the menu for a QR code that you can scan to walk you through the steps to set up Smart HQ. The combo drum may be fully loaded with loosely added items. Consult the owner's guide for the various types of loads and the recommended cycle for each. To get the best drying efficiency, it is important to start with a clean lint filter. Check both sides of your filter and clean if necessary. Never operate the combo without its filters in place. Consult the ultra-fast combo clean lint filter video for more detail on thoroughly cleaning the filter and filter area. Now you are ready to power on the combo. Let's review the control panel before selecting a cycle. The control panel contains the following buttons, power and start pause, wash and dry buttons that allow you to select a complete wash and dry cycle or a wash only or a dry only cycle separately. Several wash dry cycles that you can choose based on your type of load and even a download option for additional cycle. As on any washer, you can adjust the soil, temperature and spin levels. And since the combo is a fully functioning washer and dryer, there are a full assortment of wash and dry options located to the right side of the controls. Finally, for special settings and access to help features, you can review the items contained in the menu here. The LCD display will confirm the cycle you have selected, the approximate time remaining until the end of the cycle and the cycle status for wash and dry modes. The light ring will show a single LED next to the cycle you have selected until you start the cycle. Once started, it will then display a representative countdown of the total cycle with the left half in blue tracing the wash cycle and the right half in magenta tracing the dry cycle. In addition, the LCD display may indicate actions to remind you to clean the filter, refill your smart dispense tanks, guide you through Wi-Fi setup, or display certain warning messages. Now, let's select a cycle. By default, the combo assumes that you want to run a full wash-dry cycle. However, you can choose to run a wash-only or dry-only cycle. Your choices are confirmed on the LCD display. You can either use the default settings for the selected cycle, or you may adjust each cycle by choosing certain wash and or dry options. If using the Smart Dispense system, ensure that the tanks are filled and that each Smart Dispense button is activated on the display. Consult the ultra-fast combo dispenser video for more detail on the use, care, and cleaning of the Smart Dispense system. If you want to manually add detergent, and if desired, bleach and fabric softener, use the top dispenser drawer. When ready, press the Start Pause button and let the combo do the washing and drying thanks to no load transfer. If desired, check the Smart HQ app on your phone for notifications, to adjust options, add more dry time, or to learn more about the combo. To add items after the combo is started, press Start Pause and wait until the door is unlatched. The combo may take up to 20 seconds to unlock the door after pressing Start Pause. After the door unlocks, open gently, add items, close the door, and press Start Pause to restart. Because your combo dries clothes at a consistent temperature in a sealed drum, they may not feel as dry or as warm on first touch as you are used to with a traditional dryer. Just take them out and shake them out and they will feel dry in a few seconds. We hope that you enjoy using your innovative GE Profile Ultra Fast Combo. For more detailed information, please consult your owner's guide or our other Ultra Fast Combo videos. You can also visit the GE Appliances Combo webpage.